who is a compositor let me begin from the top to the bottom a skilled compositor should be able to layer various elements together in a way that will make them appear as if they naturally belong in the same space let me give you a typical example let's say you have a script with a scene where a chopper in the midst of an apocalypse has to land on top of a building pick a couple of dudes and take off again this scene just like any other similar scene would first of all require a plate which will be our background so in this instance the plate will consist of the whole city in this particular scene with the chopper placed in the foreground now this is what happens the animator animates the chopper the fx artist adds particles could be anything that contributes to distraction once this is all rendered out the compositor layers the chopper distribution particles replaces the plate with building color matches and z depth to bring it all together sounds simple but harder than a nipple i wouldn't speak on z depth because it's not in wait z depth is very important okay you can set that up on google and i'm sure you would find something there on z depth or maybe i might document something on z depth and leave it in my description below when i upload this video like i said let's do it from top to bottom i hope you remember that Nowadays, a small inexpensive green screen is easy to come by. It won't be the same quality as a blockbuster film, but it's good enough to practice keying with. Pick one up and shoot simple scenes with a couple of friends. Work on keying and replacement. Get a similar shot without a screen to practice rotoscoping. Now, these are essential skills for a junior compositing artist. You need them because you can't enter into this field without not grasping this at your fingertips if you want to become a compositor it is important that you understand the basics of compositing there are many techniques and workflows used in 3d compositing and the specific process can vary depending on the project and software being used the most basic concept every junior artist should know includes color theory vector graphics keying and rotoscoping and maybe camera tracking there is a long definition for compositing but this is how i define compositing combining CG elements with live shots. There are tons of compositing softwares out there to look into if you are now starting out. A couple of them will be Autodesk, Flame, Nuke, FuseFX, Blackmagic Fusion, After Effects and Natron. There is also Smoke but a Smoke still in use because it's been a long while since I saw anybody use it. They are all not the same guys, they are different based on star, available depth of tools, features and workforce. Now this is how I would categorize them. To work in bigger pipelines, you can go in for Black Magic Fusion Studio, Flame and Fuse, FX or Nuke. Yeah. To work in small to mid-range studios, use After Effects, Black Magic Fusion Studio or Fuse FX. To work in small skilled firms, you can go in for Blender, After Effects or Natron or Black Magic Fusion free version yeah if you are a freelancer then either natron after effect blender or black magic fusion free version will be okay if you love this video kindly don't forget to subscribe like share until my next video peace out